Hey Taurus, we're getting right into your reading on how your person is feeling about you. We have the Ace of Wands in reverse, so um, we're feeling this. They're feeling disappointment at the moment. Like there's a delay here that things aren't manifesting the way they want with you. You could be dating this person, the hangman here. They're waiting to um, lift these burdens on how they're feeling about you. However, there's a lot of weight that they're carrying in their personal lives. That they're struggling to tell you how they feel here with the two of pentacles they're weighed down in their work or finances at the moment they don't want to feel like um that they're ghosting you they feel this love with the ten of cups they want to come forward with the chariot cancer energy to tell you how they feel they see you know the, the white picket fence the marriage the kids the happiness here the emotional happiness and they want to come out of conflict with you um, but some of you, you could have told this person, you know, you're working too much or they're overworking here. Clear for the hangman. What do they want to say? Yeah. It's like they're kind of being selfish at the moment, um, fulfilling their cups before they balance the scales with you, give you their justice here. Uh, you could be dealing with the Libra Taurus. So just be mindful of this energy here that if you're waiting for this person, don't wait, live your life because... They're working on themselves at the moment with the Eight of Pentacles. So again, you again you could be dating with this person. You haven't heard from them, and this is why they're working on their finances, their work here. This person could also be someone wanting to come in and be with you here, work hard on this, but they're hanging, they're stagnant here. Why? Because there's sort of sadness here with the Page of Cups. Clarify the Ten of Wands energy. Yeah, they're scared to tell you how they feel. They're scared that you're going to not want this offer here. I think they're hiding on how much, like, it could be helping out other family members or friends here. And they're feeling really weighed down. You know, they're fighting other people off. They're trying to work on things with you here. This could be that they're taking care of family members or just family. They're their breadwinner. And it's distracting them from their love life with you. And they're trying to work on this. It's taking your emotions away, her Taurus. You're kind of feeling left out. Clarify the two of Pentacles. And this is how they're feeling about you. Yeah. It's something with money that they don't feel like they... It's like they're trying to balance out you and this money situation here. Where they're being cold and they want to apologize to you. Yeah, this is, I feel like if you're dating this person, don't take this cup with the four cups here. Um, They're not going to offer you exactly what you want. Why is the five of pentacles here? If you do, you're just going to go out there, be in hardship after hardship here. Yeah, we have the moon and the sun here. here. Could be dealing with the Pisces or a Leo here. Yeah, it's fair to say you're dealing with someone who's just way down. It's just really heavy energy. Like, leave this person alone. Like, it's just, you have better coming here. They're just really into their work. They could be really full of themselves. But things that are hidden, literally, things that are hidden are coming to light. We have the moon and the sun and the five of pentacles here. I feel like this is what's going to come out. They could be hiding about money. They could be more broke than they were here. Clarify the chariot. Yeah. Coming out of frustration and wanting to come towards you. They know that they hurt you here, which is why they want to come forward and balance things out. This temperance energy. They're becoming unstuck about it in their thoughts. Because they're trying to heal things with you. Hmm. Here about the Ten of Cups. Yeah. I feel like you leaving them or you giving them the cold shoulder with that Queen of Swords is stroking their ego. Which is why they're coming back really fast and giving you this offer here. But they're not listening to their... They're not thinking logical with it. Like, they're not thinking about you, their emotions with you. They're in their heads. Like, they're uh, um, egotistical is what I'm getting. Clarify the Five of Swords. I mean, Five of Wands in reverse. Uh, Virgo energy here. You could be withdrawn. Just don't want to deal with this anymore. You feel taken advantage of and you're just done. Clarify the Eight of Swords. Yeah, Taurus. They're disappointed that, you know... I feel like they're watching you too from this breakup. They're disappointed how they treated you. And that's why they're coming in to choose which cup to give you. But it's going to be a cup of bullshit. Yeah. The world's just going to say let this person go. Because if you take this person back, it's just going to, nothing's going to change. It's just going to be stagnant with the four of swords here in the Wheel of Fortune in reverse. The Ace of Cups is continue, you know, going to be in, in reverse. There's no love here. It's only about his cup. You know, selfishness, their cup here, energy-wise energy here as well with the King of Cups. Could be feminine or masculine. 
But the only worry about their cup, I went into, mm, yeah, don't take this cup. Don't. Because you can see this Ace of Cups in reverse. We're not thinking about, they're only thinking about their own. All right? I think I repeated myself a million times. <laughs> yeah, don't. Look at this. Move on. Take action somewhere else. Look at that Queen and King of Wands in reverse. If you do take this person back, it's going to be very tumultuous and just really toxic. You don't want that. All right, because that outdated thinking, conditioning, replaying events over in your head. Yeah. Keys on a ring. Many options. Decision. Unconventional. String along. One night stand. Separation. Exactly. Sadness. Missing you. Thinking about you. Yearning. Unsure. Future. But again, cup of bullshit is what this cancer is uh, going to give you. It's for your vices if you're dealing with one. We have... The sword on the rose, exactly. Accept the truth, clarity, revelation, solidarity, force, honor, protection, and power. This is all for your protection because you are going to get the love that you deserve. We have wedding rings, union, wedding, marriage, soul connection, and internal love, everlasting problems. Once you get rid of this, that soul connection is definitely going to come in here. Like, Taurus, this connection is definitely blocking you from finding true love. You need to get away from this here because... They feel for you, but it's they're so egotistical and full of themselves here. They don't really care about you. And if you saw that Queen of Cups was in reverse here, they don't care about your feelings, all right? I'm an honest reader. You guys know that. So I hope I'm not too harsh here. I really appreciate everyone for support. Take care, guys.